Starting in MMA can be really, really tough. So that's why today I'm gonna to show you a step-by-step -step guide on how you can get started. Step one, find your niche and start doing outreach ASAP. Now you don't really need a domain, you don't need a website or a fancy course to do this. First thing you wanna do is go on Google Maps, find a business you wanna work with that is in your niche. Some of the best niches I would recommend, I can show you right here. Choose one of these niches and then start doing outreach in this. Now, if it's local businesses, I would recommend doing cold calls and with ecom you can try more on the Gmail and the messaging. Uh, but general local businesses like the dentist, like yeah, like these businesses, you want to do with cold calls. Then you want to click on this business you want to work with. You want to go onto their website, and when you're on the website, you want to try to find the name of the owner. You want to try to get a message directly to the owner or get the number directly to the owner. If you're from Norway, you can go to prof.no where you can find the owner's name or you can just go on so maybe search on Google, search uh, the business name and then owner and then maybe it comes up there. There's a lot of different ways you can check, you can see if you can find the owner's name. Now when you find the owner's name, you can choose a couple of different outreach methods which I have covered in a recent video and if you're going to choose, let's say, cold calls, which I would recommend for local businesses, now, what you want to focus on in the cold call, uh, if you're going to choose cold call, is try to hit their pain points in the call. Now, from my experience, the, more, the biggest pain point or the biggest problem the businesses are experiencing is the lack of customers in the door or lack of products being sold if you're going to do e-commerce. Generally, you just want to ask, like, are you looking for new customers? Uh, are you fully booked this week? Uh, and just generally ask questions that will kind of hit their pain points and then just offer a solution like yeah I'm a marketing agency that helps businesses like yours to get new customers uh, is that something you would be interested in, in uh, learning about and when you're on the cold call uh, this is generally where sales matters a lot so if you just have any experience in sales or you can also learn on YouTube a lot about sales but generally in experience you will learn the most uh, and also the more you do cold calls, the more you do outreach, the more you will learn uh, in general in sales. And then you just get them on the intro call where you just ask questions about their business and then you get them on a demo call where you close them as a client. If you want a more in-depth video on how to perform the intro call and demo call, uh, just let me know and I will gladly make a video on how you can do that. Now after you've got a client and you're going to do ads for them, uh, you can do two things. You can either do it yourself like I did myself, which is which can be really good because you get experience, you get to know a little bit about marketing, and you generally get to know type sales, marketing, and all that. And then again, since I do it myself, I don't have to pay a contractor, which is the second thing, uh, is you can hire a contractor. Now, what this is, is that you hire a person to run the ads for you. Now, you can do this through Upwork, you can do this through finding them on Facebook, you can literally do it from anywhere where they do the ads for your client, uh, and you're just kind of the middleman and then you're gonna pay them a little bit of what the client is paying you you can choose what you what what you think is the best but if they run ads for you they're probably gonna do it really well because they have experience and they know what you they know what they're doing so literally you can just choose what you want yourself uh, personally I don't have any opinions really on which one is the best uh, really if you want to get to know yourself you do it yourself if you're really new uh, literally it's the ways you can do it if you really knew you get to know about marketing and sales if you really knew also and you don't don't know what you're doing you can hire someone else to do it so it really depends on what you want to do. In the next video I'm going to show you some different type of outreach like what you can say and some emails that I've used that have worked and some cold calls that I've used that also have worked like some scripts uh, so yeah if you'd like to see that let me know and uh, thank you for watching